Rufus was a rebel and a non-conformist. His mummy and daddy wanted him to play the cello and become a respectable Eurocentric classical musician. Instead, Villa Lobos sneaked out and played the guitar on the streets with the best Shora musicians of Rio de Janeiro. He loved the street, the smell and the diverse people of Brazil. He wanted their voice and culture to have a place in the concert hall. He wanted to reimagine what was so special and unique about his culture and the people. And he wanted to bring that to the rest of the world. He loved a tall story. He smoked the fattest cigars. And he had the biggest laugh and an ego and heart the size of Brazil. There was nothing small about the man or his music. painted in his music with oil. He was not a watercolor man. You can smell the street, you can hear the shoro, the samba in the rhythms and the bossa nova in his chords before bossa nova even existed. You have to tap your feet, you clap your hands, you sing. Why the electric guitar? The classical guitar is a vertical instrument. The notes have a shorter sustain and are often separated by space and silence. The electric guitar is a horizontal instrument, the sustain is longer and the notes connect like you connect them when you sing. It rediscovers the guitar repertoire on another dimension with different things to say. The electric guitar is oil, not a watercolor or a pastel. There are hundreds of aquarelles of the man. It's time to paint him in oil. Time to reimagine the reimaginer. Tristarosa, the music of Villa Lobos on the electric guitar, is released in late June 2021 on Aldila Records. Mm -hmm.